In this video, we're going to discuss the Ease Scan Tool Launcher for version 11. As you can see on my desktop here, the Scan Tool is installed, and you see the desktop icon, Ease Scan Tool Launcher 11. You'll also notice in the bottom right hand area over here, in the notification area or the system area or sys tray, um, you'll see a little Ease icon. The launcher can be opened, launched at any point. You can double click on the desktop icon. You can see it opens up the launcher where we can see the various car manufacturers or again you could launch it from down here in the bottom right in the sys tray just click on that it'll open the launcher up the launcher is divided into various tabs that you can see in this area right here and you'll see I'm on the USA tab now for domestic vehicles this is where you're going to find generic OBD2 launcher you can launch the Chrysler tool from here there's GM pre OBD2 this is GM OBD2 Ford Pre-OBD2 and Ford OBD2. Now some of these um, icons when you click on them like Ford and so on are going to have multiple options. So for Ford you can just launch generic um, for Ford vehicles or you can actually go into enhanced Ford for all the enhanced controllers, powertrain, body chassis and so on. GM is very similar to that. Uh, if we go over here to the Asian tab, this is where you'll find all the Asian manufacturers that we have support for in the eScan tool right now. Again, they're just all listed here and so on. And again, you may or may not see various options like I showed you in GM. I'll show you uh, like Toyota, for instance. Toyota is a little unique. You can have just generic OBD2 on Toyota. You can open up the enhanced, again, OBD2, powertrain, body chassis, all the various controllers from here. Or on pre OBD2, there's also support for uh, manual DTC flashing on a lot of Toyota vehicles. Um, let's go over here to Nissan. Again, you can see generic or Nissan. So you get the idea there. Over here in Euro, you'll see the manufacturers um, listed here. For European vehicles right now, we only have generic coverage. So opening up any of these will just um, open up the generic tool, but will um, separate the vehicles for the OEM that you selected. Another tab at the bottom here is tools. There's a uh, you know various other tools that we have. Right now I have the uh, PC gas um, software installed, and this is the software that runs with our four and five gas analyzers. The internet tab is um, handy links from the launcher for you to go out and check for web updates. You can uh, do that from in the tool at any time or from the launcher. This website opens up. Um, various helpful links to OEM websites and repair sites and so on. Support takes you to our support website for again technical support related to the scan tool and if for some reason you need to call in and our one of our tech support technicians needs to log into your PC you're gonna do that from this location right here just click on remote support and then they'll help you get set up so they can log on to your PC and uh, take care of the problem. And the last tab is unlock and this is where if you need to uh, update your tool or change your access code for any reason, you can go to this icon right here, or again, you can do it from inside the tool from any location. Um, also, you see on the screen here at the very bottom here, there's a, a link to a different uh, website area with various updates and so on. When we have updates coming out or information about trade shows and other news, we'll put it at the very bottom here. So again, that you know updates and so on, you can just scroll through the latest information and see what's going on right there. And again, that's how the launcher works. I'm just going to go back to the USA tab here and let's just open up the GM tool. Again, you can just click GM, click Enhance GM and you can see it open up the GM scan tool. And it takes you right to the main task selection screen which we're going to cover, which we are going to cover in another video.